Construction on the $250 million mixed-use Sterling Hurricane Hole Development Project on Paradise Island targeting the completion deadline with the first concrete pour taking place today on site. Senior Executive Vice President of Sterling Global Financial, Kalis Roll, says construction is slightly ahead of schedule with infrastructure and they're ready to go vertical on phase one. He said the concrete pour marks an important milestone on the development, which includes redesigning the marina to be the only only mega yacht marina in the country and the Caribbean. This is the largest foreign direct investment project that is done by a Bahamas-based company in the Bahamas right now. Um, I think we um, will contribute significantly to the jobs uh, market as well as the overall economic benefit to the country. So we are very excited about the role we are playing in economic development for the Bahamas. Now, phase one of the project is expected to be completed by June of next year and will feature two three-story structures with retail, retail boutiques on the ground floor, professional office space and luxury condos. Sales director of Waypoint, Patrick Leonhan, says 75% of the condos are already sold and 75% of the retail is already leased. Literally have uh, had eight of the residences purchased in the first two weeks of our of our 12. Um, and it's like Kayla had mentioned, this is a an opportunity that uh, Paradise Island hasn't seen. We, we haven't had an opportunity to really have any new construction in, in the last 10 years or so. Um, to be able to have that in addition to the shopping, I think it's really gonna bring the, the entire community of Paradise Island together.